Don't try to target keywords that everybody's obsessed with ranking for. Let me show you how to use Wincher to find keywords that make a difference. Click on the Keyword Research button right here. The tool will automatically generate a variety of suggestions for you to choose from. Next to Suggestions, you'll find the Related Keywords tab. Here you can explore new keyword opportunities by experimenting with seed words. Also, you can go through keywords from your Google Search Console. Found something relevant? Handpick the keywords you want to track or add all of them by clicking on Select All Rows. When finished, just hit the Add Keywords button and the keywords will be added to your daily rank tracking. Don't want some keywords to ever be suggested to you? Feel free to hide them. Changed your mind? Click on the Hidden tab and unhide to see them again. Personally, I love filtering keywords before going through them, and here's why. It's much easier to find specific keywords by adding a specific keyword or narrowing the search to the number of words you want. Also, it's much easier to increase your rankings for a keyword that is already close to the first page. That's why I like to adjust positions as well. Filtering traffic and volume will let you have a clear picture of what potential these keywords have. And competition will show you how hard and expensive it might be to compete for those keywords in Google Ads. Next, I want to show you how to save time by using groups. This feature allows you to organize your keywords into groups and access group-level data with just a few clicks. Go to the Group tab, click on Create Your First Group, name it, and add as many keywords as you want from the drop-down list right here. When finished, click on Create Group, and you're all set. When the group is created, you have multiple ways to use it. You can add keywords to the group by clicking on the Keywords tab, selecting those you wish to group together, and clicking on Assign to Group. Now you just need to select which group you want these keywords to be assigned to, then click Assign. Click on a star and your keywords will be added to Favorites. You can easily filter out your keywords by your group's name, and the dashboard will adjust accordingly. For instance, the brand group will include only brand searches, so you can check the results and traffic you get from branded keywords only. The same applies to blog. You can group all the keywords related to your blog and evaluate the performance of the blog URLs only. Now you can see the position changes in the selected date range, the average position for all added keywords, the traffic they generated, and the number of first positions you've earned. Also, if you want to quickly switch between desktop and mobile, you can click this button up here and the dashboard will change accordingly. If you don't yet track your keyword performance in the mobile search, this is a great place to start. If you scroll down, you'll see a whole list of keywords we've previously added, followed by columns like Features, to show you which special features were visible in the search results. Position, you can click on it to get visualized data for each added keyword. Traffic, to show you an estimated number of clicks each month. Estimated volume for each keyword that your domain can potentially get. SERP button will show your page among others in search results. And the best page will define the exact page that ranks the highest for the specific keyword. You see how simple it is? Feel free to subscribe and leave a comment down below if anything was unclear. And if you're ready to see your rankings skyrocket, then you'll definitely want to check out Wincher. Click on the link below to grab a 14-day free trial. No card details, no obligation, no hassle. High rankings, y'all, and see you soon on Wincher.com.